<laughs> there's an anti Euler's anti Sadiq Khan van right behind me. <laughs> like, <laughs> stop Sadiq Khan. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to 2CTV. We are um, live from Westminster, as I said. We are wait just waiting for a, a huge number of tractors to get down to Parliament Square. We already have a basically, I'm a little bit early, but there I can actually s I can see them. I can see the lights. They're coming from um, Millbank. Um, I was told that we, we expect a huge number of tractors uh, on the way towards Parliament Square. We're just outside Parliament now. And we already have a group of people already arriving early behind me. Um, we're going to show you guys these guys first. We also got anti Sadiq Khan people. Look. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Maya. <laughs> almost, almost. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Sing it, sing it. So you come out, go on. We've got to do this for Johnny. We've got to do this for Johnny because she watches him all the time. Oh, okay. Hello, oh, Johnny. Hello, oh, Johnny. We're all here. <laughs> Absolute chaos. <laughs> get Khan out. Get Khan out. Get Khan out. <laughs> Uh, they're still debating whether they should sing Get Con Out or the other one. Go on! <laughs> London's not got toxic air! London's got a toxic mayor! London's not got toxic air! London's got a toxic mayor! Get Con Out! Get Con Out! Get Con Out! So, we got more people here, so basically, if you just Thanks show us that, you do, Thank man. you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Cheers, mate. So, we got all these people here. Who arrived already early? We got more people over there. Hey, mate, you right? And over there, we got more British patriots. But we are just, just waiting. Within the next couple of hey, mate, right? yeah, yeah, I can see the light. So within the next couple of minutes, we're going to see the farmers arriving, the tractors. These are, of course, we got the supporters already waiting for them. I, I think I can show you. Actually, let's go here. Let's go here while we're waiting for the tractors. Hey, mate, how's it going? Hey. Mate. There you go. There you go. Oh, good, good, Thanks, good. mate. Cheers. You know they're coming in. Yeah, I can see the light. I can see the light. Hang on, guys. This is the preview. I don't know if you can see towards the end. Those are the tractors coming towards Parliament, ladies and gentlemen. We got. Apparently, I was told about a couple of hundred. I do, I, I'm not giving you the promise, but I was told by the organisers we probably have about a couple of hundred tractors. Oh, because in each one of them we got a huge small group of farmers representing uh, different parts of the country all getting to central London as we speak outside the mother of all parliaments how's the parliament and there uh, we got supporters already waiting back British farmers we got the signs here we got the the furnace for British farmers as well <laughs> hey, mate. Uh, everyone's already left up place everyone's gonna go towards <laughs> we can just wait for them though hang on so everyone was supposed to wait by Winston Churchill the Churchill statue but it seems like a, I don't know why they're walking towards the tractors the tractors are coming here anyway I don't know what's going on uh, can you guys hear me and see me properly in the live chat I, I just uh, turned on the microphone without checking <laughs> I might be talking to myself for the past three minutes hang on they're coming now there we go, let me show you again. This is going to be beautiful. The MPs are not going to be expecting any of this. <laughs> we got farmers representing everywhere up and down the country. The tractors are now approaching! The tractors are approaching. There we go, you can see them, right? With the union flag. <laughs> yeah, they, they took the time. <coughs> hey, man, how do you, right? Yeah, not bad. No farmers, no food. Everyone's getting... Why is everyone going towards them? They're coming here anyway. <laughs> okay, let's go, let's go. Let's follow the crowd. Let's follow the crowd because... <laughs> not really sure why we're not standing... Oh my God! Oh, le guys! Ladies and gentlemen, we got the farmers. <laughs> Lay. Bro, everyone's getting, everyone's getting. Let's get closer, let's get closer. Your escort vehicle. Stop getting farming. You're watching this live on TCTV. The mainstream media is not here to report it, but it's okay because TCTV is here. No too bad import. 
back British farmers. <laughs> got people waving. <laughs> Wow, we've got more people coming. Absolute scene in the middle of Westminster, right outside the main entrance to the House of Parliament. Look at that. And we've got black cab drivers, taxi drivers showing support. Ordinary London has also have arrived. You got this one. UK, save the UK food security. Another one, and of course, we've got the Union flags left, right, and center on top of each tractor. <laughs> Back British farming, fur trade for British farmers. Another one with a bigger flag. The flags are getting bigger with each tractor. <laughs> I was expecting about five to ten tractors tonight. I thought it was going to be about ten tractors coming to central London. I can assure you it's far more than ten tractors who have come to central London to occupy Parliament Square. No farmers, no food, no future. This is crazy. Every single tractor showing their patriotism with the union flags. We've got independent reporters and journalists as well, of course. Where is the BBC? Where is Sky News? They might be a bit late, but I'm sure they're watching this right now. And it's okay, they can get here, they have time. Stop, stop, standard imports. <clears throat> I'm standing in the middle of the road to get the best angle. <laughs> Crazy. This is just the beginning of it. So far we've had, I think about what, 20 tractors? We got far more coming. That's why it took them ages to get, oh, look at that one. Hang on, let's go. Wait, <laughs> right, let's wait for them. That one is interesting. So this is literally the House of Parliament where the MPs are too busy eating subsidized food and drinks while we are here. Let's wait for the bike to go. Look at that one. <laughs> How long did it take to get here? We've been here since half ten this morning. Oh wow. So we got more coming. <laughs> ah look at that one. No farmers, no food, no future. Amazing. <laughs> farmers waving. The backbone of British society and British economy. <laughs> look at look at the number of tractors, guys. I thought it's going to be about ten of them, five to ten. <laughs> I think we're going to get close to about two hundred, as they said. This is great. Look at this. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> we have AFP behind me uh, from the mainstream media. Let's get closer to the other guys. They're all waving. <laughs> Ban dishonest labeling. This is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Because we've got the police just in case. We've got more Londoners waiting to just wave at them to show support. Huge traffic now has been caused. <laughs> I'm just going to keep walking. I'm <laughs> because I think if we get to Parliament Square, that's when we're going to see the main gathering anyway. We got supporters out. Okay. Hang on, 
Let me talk to these guys. Bring it down. Can't open. Oh, there's no window. <laughs> How long did it take to get here? Uh, to get here, what, from where we were parked at Covent Garden, only about 10 minutes, caught from now, the police... Where did you come from today? Yeah, yeah. Oh, to get up, oh, two and a half hours. Oh, really? Drove. From where? We're from West Sussex. Oh, oh amazing, West, West Sussex. Sussex. Yeah, I'm because I watch your... Oh, brilliant. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, we got some bodies on TCTV, obviously. <laughs> we're going to talk to more of them as they get here. Look at this! Wow! So, I need to decide because I think at this point, what I'm going to do I'm going to walk back to Parliament Square because look at this, if I keep walking, I'm going to get to probably Canada and uh, so not get hit by a car that would be a good idea okay I think there's a bit of space now they're all driving now so <clears throat> got a massive helicopter I don't know if you can see yeah there up there can't tell if that's a police or a sky news helicopter but uh, could be it's probably media I don't know uh, with this gathering the size of the gathering Sky News and BBC News are not going to be able to ignore it, unlike the previous protests. This is huge. And the MPs have to respond. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let me show you exactly. This is crazy. I'm so glad I live nearby, otherwise it would have taken me ages to get here. <laughs> See uh, the Elizabeth Tower. Big Ben. All the tractors. This is crazy. Oh wow. I think they're gonna go around Parliament Square and everybody is standing in the middle of Parliament Square, the supporters of the farmers. The absolute scenes in Westminster. <laughs> Look at this. I think we got GB News here. Yeah. Okay, let's go to here. The police have now stopped this side to ensure security, I think. Look at that. Look at all the British Patriots. They've come out to show support to hundreds of farmers who've come out today. Hundreds, hundreds of tractors. Look at the crowd. Hi, how are you? <laughs> this is huge. <laughs> so many. I know. I thought it was going to be like 10. Okay, so now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go here. Right. I guess, <laughs> I've got more support higher. <laughs> Good turnout. Huge. Huge. Yeah, go on, selfie time. I know. <laughs> yes, How are you? Oh, hello. Come here. Time. Are you live? Uh, we are live. Mom! <laughs> Mom. It's Maya! <laughs> Mum! What is he? Mum's your time! Yeah! Say to Martin, happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Martin Robinson! Uh, Robinson, Mum. Mum's Robinson. Oh, I've got Maya on my phone. Oh. Amazing. We've got criminals everywhere. Hey, Steve Laws, hello. I don't know if you heard that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Tommy, 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 Tommy,
<laughs> so the police are trying to manage the line because uh, it will be chaotic if all the tractors completely take over Parliament Square. There's so many of them. They, 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 Why is that tractor waiting? Okay, let's go. We're gonna go this way. Right. Oh, they're, they're coming now, they're coming. <laughs> now they're allowed to come. Where are the others? Oh, right. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, let's join them on the other side. We need to go find the others. We've got at least about a couple of hundred tractors in Parliament Square in Westminster. And we've got a lot of people who come out to show support. I need to find a way to cross the road without getting killed. I think that'll be ideal. Hang on. Okay, let's go. Whoa, 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 I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. There we go, I'm here now. Hi, hi, how are you? <laughs> there we go, that's a better angle. Beautiful gathering. Look at this. Where are they going? Hang on, let's, let's find out. Where are the other tractors? Where did they go? Do you know where the other tractors go? Yeah. They, they went all which way? They're going around. Look. They're going around. Oh, yeah. Oh, right, right, okay. Oh, they, apparently they're going around, so they, they, they're on the other side now. Okay. All right, let's have a look at these. In the meantime, we're going to have a lot of them arriving now. This is the most patriotic protest I've seen in a long time. <laughs> this is crazy, guys. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, yeah go on. <laughs> Thank you. Well done. Oh, wow. Look at this. We got the anti Sadiq Khan van arriving as well. Again. <laughs> Anti Sadi Khan van. The, the red one. <laughs> Imagine. No, no. He's, he's fled the capital. <laughs> this is great. Everyone's clapping. Can't, can't stop. Let's go on this side. We look, if you think this is the end of uh, the tractors, you will be surprised what I'm about to show you. Look, <laughs> look on the other side. Hang on. We got much more coming. Got a lot more coming. All the Londoners showing support.
This is how you do it, guys. This is how you do a protest. Oh my god, look on the outside. <laughs> some of these uh, banners and signs. <clears throat> this is the messaging about um, food labeling, make food labeling honest. This one says uh, urgent message from farmers. What does it say? We can't afford... Hi there, how are you? <laughs> we, we can't afford to feed you I know, it's big, big, big gathering, huge. Yeah, a lot huge. of faces I know. Nigel, how are you? <laughs> I, I got a laugh. So turn it off, one second. So one of my mates... Uh, got Nigel Evans. All oh, right, <laughs> <laughs> the other way. <laughs> Yeah, no bad. Just oh, wave at, at least wave. Yeah, yeah. See. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was Nigel Evans, the deputy speaker of the House of Commons, a good friend of mine. Um, <laughs> he just made a joke about the French. <laughs> Couldn't get it on the camera. <laughs> You'll get cancelled. Let's just say. But yeah, Nigel Evans, uh, deputy speaker. Let's. Uh, where were we? Hang on. All oh, right. Come on, look at this. Hi. <laughs> Come here. How are you? No, good, thank you. Hey, listen. Oh, did you get it? Save British farming, farmer's daughter. I'm literally like run all the way down. I was saying. Oh, this place is vegan lies. I was there from the start, right at the bottom, because they moved, because they're on Defra land. Because they're on Defra land, they had to move from New Common Garden, so they went down near Vauxhall. So I was there. How oh, crazy. Wow. Yeah. Oh, wow. it's amazing that you're here. Yeah, thank you. There's still more coming, apparently. <laughs> yeah, there's loads, about 100. Wow. About 100, it's sick. I was so sick. I was so buzzed. It's like the best, best protest I've ever been in my life. Yeah. Because obviously I'm a farmer's daughter, so it means a lot to me. Yeah. So. It's about time. The there we go. <laughs> Scottish and English. Wow. Scottish and Union. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Hey, hello. There it is. All right. Bye-bye. All right, let's get back. Fellow fascists. <laughs> Look at this, beautiful. Fascist in the bedroom. <laughs> Libertarian. Oh, yeah, cars. cars are coming. Guys, guys. No, they have cars. They have to move. It's almost at 6 25 pm on a. Is it Wednesday? Is it, is it, I don't know what day it is. Monday is, it, is Monday. No, it's Monday. <laughs> it's a Wednesday. It's, I don't know what day it is anymore. Monday, 25th of March. <laughs> and we're still witnessing more tractors getting to Parliament Square. Look at this beauty. Yeah. My missus loves your channel, mate. Ah, thank you. Every time you go live or you do something, she's on it. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> about 150 tractors in this convoy. Wow. Alright, I'm gonna go around. Come with me, guys. Look at these uh, beautiful British patriots who come out to sh show support to the British farmers. Back British farmers, do it. And of course, stop Eulers at the same time. Stop Eulers. Stop Sadiq Khan. Hundreds and hundreds of farmers are still joining Parliament Square. These are the new tractors joining the crowd. We got the, the others on the other side. Of 
of course, they're, they're all going around <coughs> with the main crowd that gets gathered here. Alright, let's go on the other side of the road if we can without getting hit. Alright, let's go. Sorry. Okay, now we can do this. <laughs> wow. Net Zero aims to make farmers extinct, this sign says. Beep for freedom, guys. Beep for freedom. <laughs> farmers offered £100,000 to retire. Why? Good question. This is the question that the MPs in this building must answer. Oh no, bad news guys, we got someone with loud music. This is how we get copyrighted. Oh no. Let's move. Let's move. I don't want trouble. <laughs> Ian in the live chat says, free, free Farmerstein. I love that. Still more tractors coming. I cannot believe this. I was never expecting a protest like this, a farmers' protest like this in central London, but it's actually happening. <laughs> Net zero scam. Eat the bugs. No farmers, no food. House of Lords crossing the road, ignoring the protest. Another sign saying ban dishonest labeling. That's a big tractor. Oh wow. Where is Jamie Clarkson? Where is Jamie Clarkson? <laughs> Jeremy, if you're watching this, you better be on your way. <laughs> Where is Clarkson? Start chanting. <laughs> Look at this. A 
Okay, more music. I'm not going that way. No one copyright. Parliament is now, Parliament Square is now fully occupied by farmers and the protesters of farmers, British patriots and everybody. Still no words from MPs inside that building so far. This is how you protest, Britain. With a number of uh, tractors and farmers here. Not only the MPs in that building can't ignore them anymore, the mainstream media can't ignore them anymore. They have to be here now. I've seen a couple of guys now from uh, Sky News and uh, BBC and one person from GB News, all the corporate back media are going to have to now report this. They can't pretend nothing happened in central London tonight. Let's go back here. Obviously, I got here first. Thanks to you guys. Thanks to everybody who told me the details. We work together on TCTV because we are the media. <clears throat> There's still more tractors coming. Yeah, it's still more as low because what they're doing is they're not, they should have shut the road off, you know, so they were in full yeah, force and yeah. they haven't done that. So now they're like dispersed now, going through traffic, which pissed me off because when it's a Palestine protest, they shut the roads off. Yeah. So they should have done it, they knew it was coming yeah. for ages. I know, yeah. They never organised the police. Yeah, <laughs> Hundreds and hundreds of tractors. More police officers have also joined to manage this mess. <laughs> can anybody confirm if you can see BBC reporting this in a fair way or, or are they calling everybody far right? Still coming, more tractors. <laughs> that little child is saying, support British farmers, guys. Patriotic little supporters. <laughs> <laughs> That was brilliant. <laughs> Gun, good job. <laughs> Briefing. <laughs> no farmers, no future.
insane. <laughs> Also, you see, when British patriots come out to protest for a good cause, how peaceful, how loving, family-oriented, everyone's lovely, and everybody subscribes to TCTV. <laughs> Let's go back. All right. Nice to see the farming families, seeing this crowd out here who come out to stand and wait for them, to show support. I'm sure they're all grateful. Just like how the people standing here are grateful for all the work that these guys do on a daily basis throughout the whole year. Apparently, according to the live chat, the BBC are reporting that this is basically Brexit's fault. <laughs> of course, they're not going to blame our politicians or our globalist entities. Idiots. more families young old middle-aged everything <laughs> Oh, that one, that one. Do it, do it. <laughs> Ready, go. Here we are. Wait for this, guys. You're going to love it. Chanting, get Khan out, get Hall in, as in Susan Hall. <laughs> got supporters of Susan Hall. I think I can spot a couple of MPs walking around. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're still coming, by the way. Hundreds and hundreds of tractors are still joining. This is insane. I genuinely thought it was going to be like 10. And as I said earlier, I, I, nobody expected London to be completely taken over by farmers from across the country. This is beautiful. In case you don't know, in this country at least, and many other countries, the farming community are small C conservative. They're family people. They care about the local community. They stay in their community. They keep their head down. They don't protest, they don't start revolutions, but, uh, but if you make them angry, they come out, and they come out like this. What do you think of all this? Brilliant, brilliant. It's about time they, they go in the streets. Really, everyone needs to know this. It's nuts. It's 
great. I never expected London to be like yeah. that. No, it's pretty. It's like a carnival. Because farmers don't think. protest. They're not revolutionary. But yeah. if you make them angry... <laughs> they need to. They need to. They need to be out in the streets. And people need to see this. Will we see this from the BBC this evening? The Will BBC we? are blaming Brexit. <laughs> they, they would. Of course they would. That's the BBC all over. Exactly. Thank you. Government pays farmers to scale down harvest. Okay, that's my favorite with all the lights. All right, let's go back here. Join the freedom loving. <laughs> true British patriots who work hard every single day for us to be fed and the country have abandoned them until now but we are waking up you know the sad reality is right now I've been looking around for the past 43 minutes all these so-called political activists these so-called alternative politicians alternative parties not a single one of them is here. I don't see any of them here. Where are all those idiots who claim to be on the side of farmers who want to be different compared to the Labour Party and the Tories? They're not here.
Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah, cheers, mate. Yeah, go on. Then. Oh, no, really. No, he's actually taking risks. There's too many talkers, talking shop people that are not doing enough. Yeah. Yeah, no, they should. More people need to People in influential positions that have got, that are actually in a place because they've been talking all the right things, but when it really comes down to it, no, people aren't prepared to take the risks that you're taking. Thank you very much, I appreciate it. No, it's true. Thank you. Yeah. And we're at a point, we're at a point in time where our country's burning before our eyes and people are either motivated by self-interest or they're motivated by the cause. And it should be about the cause. I agree. Thank you very much. <laughs> That's nice, isn't it? One of the best things I love about coming to do sort of protest to cover British patriots fighting for British values, British farming, British families. It's not just because the media are not reporting it fairly or sometimes refusing to report it. It's also when I meet these loving people dedicated to their cause and supporting me. Um, and every time I hear these words, it's nice. Thank you so much. Every single one of you who watched these videos, who shared these videos, and who tried to fight for our values in the Western world, especially in Britain. Also, I can smell cannabis. <laughs> Someone's smoking weed here. <laughs> I don't know who. <laughs> Protect 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 the smell of weed is increasing. <laughs> I have a feeling it was those guys. Those guys walking down with the music. Somebody call 911. Stop you, Les, man. Thank you. <laughs> Someone's face saying. <laughs> <laughs> we got TCTV supporters at work. I think that's a weed game. <laughs> I can smell it now. <laughs> Encouraging people to get on the road. Freedom! 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 Come with the farmers, people! Freedom! 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 Freed
outside Parliament about 7 p.m. Monday 25th of March the police are now pushing back it's a bit of a disagreement between two police officers I think one of them is saying we shouldn't escalate it the other wants to push them back more police officers are coming now Uh, we're going now. Okay, everyone's going to Whitehall. Traitor! Traitor! You're an absolute disgusting traitor! Just get off the road for it. You never did this to BLM or just up oil. You'd be on your knees! Traitor! Traitor! Biggest call now, good man. Traitor! You're a traitor! That, actually, that, that guy in the blue vest, he was trying to help, he was trying to de-escalate, it's these guys who are trying to escalate it. <laughs> hey, what are you doing down here? I'm here, I'm always here. 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 No farmers! No food! The police are trying to contain everybody here so they don't go on Whitehall. But a small group have already gone that way on the other side of the road. I'm trying to see what's going on now because it seems to be a little bit. Are you alright just to stand on the pavement just until everyone's passed? Yeah, you guys, I just want to anyone who's new to the party. We need you guys because we've been so badly behaved. Well, you've been alright. Yeah, yeah, typical. Yeah. I hear you're the football hooligan, far right football hooligan, right? Who are you? Hi, how are you? Oh, very well. Where did you come from? Bournemouth. Oh, nice Bournemouth. I love Bournemouth. Yeah, they're like Bournemouth. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Apparently, you guys are troublemakers. Yeah, yeah, real. <laughs> Badly behaved. Revolutionaries. <laughs> Revolutionaries. <laughs> hey, well, it does like it, it does look like Karl Marx. So. <laughs> All right. They're moving. They're moving. Oh wow! Gotta get that. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> the 
this protest is still ongoing. Look at look at the tractors. They're still driving around. All right, the police are trying to control the center of um, well, the junction in Parliament Square. Because uh, a small group have already... Oh, no. Hang on. I'm going to have to cross the road because something is happening over there. Hang on. Hang on, guys. Stay with me. We're going to have to cross the road when we can. I heard you've got a good channel. <laughs> Thank you. Because I was, uh, you interviewed me in the um, oh, yeah. tractor. I, I got a lift. I didn't know that guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> amazing. That was great. <laughs> I'll check you out, man. Yeah, my cheers. Uh, let's go here because I think something's happened. More tractors, more tractors. Oh, wow, look at that. This is insanity. All right, let's go on this side. Police are still trying to manage the crowd. Let's go on this side. No food! 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 No Oh, there's a police line being created now. Still got hundreds and hundreds of uh, tractors. I don't know if you can see on Whitehall. They're all in a line. It's crazy. It's the true British spirit. I think it's time. Maya for mayor. Let's do it. <laughs> Maya for mayor. Hashtag Maya for mayor. Oh. No problem. 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 No problem.
A lot of people have been telling us that this is the sort of coverage they need from the mainstream media. Not all this wishy-washy nonsense scripted coverage, blaming Brexit and Brexiteers and farmers. A lot of the BBC coverage is basically blaming the farmers themselves, which is absolutely nonsensical. Just show the people what is happening on the ground. It's not rocket science. Don't forget guys, 23rd of April, St. George's Day, right here in Whitehall. We will all come back together. No farmers, no food. Hundreds and hundreds still joining. Ordinary Londoners have come out to show support. Look at the convoy. Look where it goes. Look at the end. You can't even see the end of it. Where's the dick car? Where's the mayor?
Legend. Thank you, man. Cheers. Where did you come from? Oh. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, I miss high five. <laughs> Thank you so much for everything. Thank you, man. We got a Londoner who's also originally from Israel behind me. So I said, I'm Israel Chai. No farmers, no food! No farmers, no food! No farmers, no food! This is the best of Britain, in case you didn't know. Well, of course, the establishment will continue to call them football hooligan, far right, whatever. Come on! Freedom! Freedom! Convoy is still coming. <laughs> Just when I think it's over. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, we're still outside. How's the Parliament? For the past 68 minutes, 69 minutes almost, we've been with you guys with a live coverage of the biggest farming process we've seen over the last few years in central London, outside Parliament. We've got British farmers coming out in huge numbers, hundreds of tractors coming from all over, over the country, especially in terms of the south. And a lot of ordinary Londoners have come out to also show support. Finally, it was about time for us to witness this solidarity, the true British spirit in action. I hope you enjoyed this content. Uh, thank you so much for all the super chat and everything else. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to check the live chat regularly. Uh, but we'll be back with you guys with the latest updates and of course we'll let you know guys know if the political establishment will respond to what we saw tonight in London. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Maya TSC and we are the media.